la 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 <sighs> Hello, I am the Canadian Romantic and I've lost my white pants. Not these pants, these are a spare and they're baggy. The pants I've lost are tight and they fit perfectly around these regions. Snug, good lines, and I miss them. If you have any, any information that could lead me to finding my white pants again, please contact me. Please, I miss them. Oh. Hey, how Ooh. are you? I'm sorry I haven't seen your white pants. Well, I have a sense of loss. Yeah, no kidding. I, 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 I naturally have white pants. I unfortunately have to project a certain fantasy. Whereas you, you have the pants au naturel, which is like a sense of reality. You're really real. Well, you thanks. Know. Yeah. It's been a real life for me. Yeah, have you ever had uh, loss? Oh, that's a big question, Mr. Canadian Romantic. My life is scarred with loss. How so? I've got scars. Okay, didn't need to see that one. Listen, you want to hear my story of loss? I'm all ears, as are you. Well, just, just a little while ago, mm -hmm. there was a movie made about me. It was a, it was a sexy, it was a deep, it was a romantic tale called the Bunny Movie. What kind of theaters did it show in? It didn't show anywhere. You know, Times Square ain't what it used to be. No, that's not the problem. The problem is burglars came into my house and stole my hard drive. Before the movie could be released to the general public to enjoy? Before anybody could see all the beautiful ladies in my movie, oh. my great acting job, nobody got to see anything. Were you all fully clothed in the movie? Well, of course not. For shame, and now it's gone. Yes, in the hands of some crackhead. Hmm. Getting off on my naked white pants. We all have our addictions. I certainly know mine, and it's a shame the movie's gone. What was the movie about? Well, it was about me and my life and, and all the romances that I go through. Was it a work of fiction? No. No. Listen, buddy, take a look. What sort of uh, details, uh, intimate uh, details, happened in, in, in your uh, well, cinematic? There was uh, there was some uh, sex scenes. There was some broken romance. There was walks in the cold in the dark. So it was very Canadian. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know, listen. It was going to make it big time. Perhaps the same burglar is the same person who's taken my pants. And if any of you have any information about what's called the bunny movie, my pants. And his pants. Separately or together, either way, this would be appreciated. Yeah, just drop it all in the mailbox if you're embarrassed, okay? So you make films, what else do you do? Well, I don't know if you know this, but I used to be, well, I guess I was uh, destined to be a big star. I mean, this, is, this goes a few years back, but I was created with a lion and, and a monkey. Wait, created? I'm created. Not, don't bunnies just sort of uh, I, I am a, I, themselves? I, I'm a puppet. I thought you were a little funny looking. Your eyes. Yeah? I can't even look straight into your eyes. Yeah? I, I can't. I try, but they're askew. They're, they're skewed eyes. Weird, man. That's weird. Mm. I know. It's because they're uh, ping pong balls. So anyway, listen. I was supposed to go to Singapore to be on this karaoke channel. And they took the lion and the monkey puppet, right? Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. they sent me back to Canada. 
Because they said I was hard to look at. It's the eyes. <laughs> it's the eyes. I mean, if the, your eyes were just more, you know, like this. You need to... This. It's the eyes. Oh, yeah, I see, I see. Just I mean, you the, have a very romantic look in your eyes. Yeah, just get a, you know, just get some uh, low-rent ghetto Geppetto to uh, fix it up straight, you know, get a regular get, ghetto, ghetto Geppetto. Ghetto Geppetto, yeah. I can hook you up. Mix yeah, well. things out of garbage for all the neighborhood children. Yeah, well, some people say it's the eyes. Other people say that my, my, my lips, they look like, come here. I got a secret. I don't think this is ready for the camera. Testicles. You're a puppet. You were created to eat the testicles. Yeah. We'll start with the eyes. Well, thank you so much for dropping by today and telling us about your non-stop problems. Well, you're welcome. Taking up our time, it's been very appreciated. It's always, it's always good to see you. You're, you're uh, tactile. Which Listen, like. where, where was, what, what about my song? I thought I was gonna get to water, play a song. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the contract. There's two things. You said that we would sing a song and we were gonna watch some of your Russ Meyers box set. Okay, uh, we'll get to that later because, you know, we, yeah, we'll get to all that later. Let's hear the song. Okay! <clears throat> it goes like this. And you can sing along with it too if you want. This is a song that I like to sing when I get down. And maybe I could pass it on to you and you can sing it to yourself when you get down. <clears throat> I'll, I'll hum a few bars. This <clears throat> is the hat. Happy bunny song. This is the happy bunny song. I'm so happy when I sing this song. This is the happy bunny song. This is the happy bunny song. This is the happy bunny song. I'm so happy when I sing this song. I'm gonna sing it all night long. That's great. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for coming. I've not actually done though. This is a happy bunny song. This is a happy bunny song. I'm so happy when I sing this song. I'm gonna sing it all night long. That's fabulous. Yeah, pretty good, huh? Yes, you did you did great today. Thank you, thank it's you. Wonderful to have you. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye.